found it interesting that even in the Garden of Eden, there were two plants growing. The plant that God had planted and something God had not planted. And unfortunately, when they partook of what God had not planted, we fell into the slump that we're in now, trying to climb out of a hole that only Christ can deliver us out of. Mm -hmm. The title of this morning's message is titled Seeds of Ignorance. Seeds of Ignorance and the Harvest of Mental Illness. Seeds of Ignorance and the Harvest of Mental Illness. There is a warfare that is going on, brothers and sisters. Turn your Bibles with me to the book of, of Psalm, uh, the 11th chapter. Seeds of Ignorance and the Harvest of Mental Illness. There is a warfare going on against the mind of man, brothers and sisters. There's a warfare going on, and I want you to see that warfare from the Bible. We're in Psalm, we're in Psalm, the 11th division, and notice what the Lord tells us. Psalm 11, notice what we read. The Bible says in verse 1, for lo, no, he says, for the Lord, uh, let me just drop down to verse 2. He says, for lo, the wicked bend their bow, they make ready their arrow upon the string, talking about the wicked, that they may privately shoot at the upright in heart. Hmm. So we are taught and told that the wicked, they bend their bow, they make ready their arrow upon the string. The Bible says that they may privately shoot at the upright in heart. What makes the private effort so dangerous? Someone gives you a birthday card on your birthday and they ask you, how's your mother? How was the children? And they seem so concerned and they're always there. When you seem to need them, you would least expect them as your enemy. Are you all with me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. When you don't know you're in a battle, how can you fight? How can you defend yourself? It's a private warfare. The wicked bend their bow. They make ready their arrow upon the string that they may privately shoot at the upright in heart. So God is telling us that our enemy likes to work from a private perspective. Hmm. When the Israelites were successful against, against uh, 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 Jericho and the other kingdoms that they had come against, what happened? Balak became afraid. So he privately went to Balaam and privately plotted against Israel. Hmm. That private plot, unfortunately, led to the most frightful departure from virtue and integrity that the history of Israel had known. Hmm. It was a private war. 